All right, today we're making my mom's guacamole. All right, I've never, I've done like tons of recipe videos for mom's chicken tacos and this and that and the third. Today we're making my mom's guacamole. And let me show you all the ingredients. So we have the seasonings all right here. Adobo, salt and pepper. We have the mozzarella cheese with the shredder. And then we have all the vegetables. You're gonna want onion, tomatoes, lime, cilantro, uh, avocados, obviously, and my favorite, serrano peppers. But be careful, cause they spicy. Let me put this back like this. I think we're good, right? So this whole video is just me chopping up veggies and mixing everything up from scratch. That's all this is uh, purpose for. Oh, and crema, of course. You need crema, Nestle table cream. Make sure you shake it up. Oh, let me get my sharpener. So we got, this is a sharpener. You see the shape of it? It's like an oval. This is a sharpener. And this is a straightener or the honing stick. That's round, see that? So what you wanna do is take your knife. That's about it. Sharpener or straightener. Kind of vegetables, so I'm not trying to impress anybody. Ooh, I should grab my my gloves because I don't want to get Serrano juice on my fingies, Mama. Is it alive? Huh? Is it alive? No. Why? Oh, you want it to be alive? Because you're talking. Huh? I'm talking. Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm supposed to talk, right? No cut glove, just regular plastic gloves. All right, Serrano's. Having these gloves is banging, mama. Having these gloves is awesome. No juice gets on me. Can you hear my wife in the background? Say hi to everybody, Abby. Hi, everybody. So I don't know if anybody out there is a uh, content creator on uh, TikTok, but I recently joined the, or I got accepted into the creator content program or whatever, where I can finally make actual real money um, on TikTok, which is nice. Kind of the same way, like I still make money on here, but back in the day, oh, like 2018, 17, around that, 19, I was making better money on YouTube. And that's really only my fault. If I would have just kept being consistent on this channel, I would have been making more money. Um, I don't know if it's like, if I, I just don't care, if I'm just lazy, I don't know what it is. But hey, I basically like the creator program on TikTok, as long as your videos are over a minute long, you get a certain amount of income and you have to turn on ads and all that stuff, So, which is nice. So I just started, we'll see how it goes if anybody, i think you need about 10 10 000 or more followers on tiktok and a certain amount of views every uh month so we'll see how that goes i cut up the serranos that's good to go uh let me cut up the tomato romas are my favorite
tighten them up. Wifey said only do one, but I'm gonna do two to be on the safe side. start separating some of this stuff because it's get crowded on this cutting board there we go Put that right there. clean that up a little bit This is a little different, right? It's a little different, cutting things up. Not eating, not doing a mukbang. Serranos. Tomatoes, serranos, let's do the onion. Jam. It's a dense as onion. The nice thing is too, the algorithm, now if you decide you want to be a content creator and make some money off of social media platforms, um, TikTok's algorithm right now is pretty, pretty crazy. That's the best way to go right now. For uh, this way. This is killing my eyes. Killing my eyes right now. Mmm. 
almost caught the fangies. Pretty set and done. Overflowing here, it's all right, it's all right. Eyes are watering, sorry. Oh, 11 minutes in, all right. Half this video is just me chopping up. Veggies, cilantro. Let's do it. Some of it smells banging. Yeah. Mm hmm. The cilantro is amazing. If that's not enough for what we're doing, I'll just have another bushel over there and we'll cut that up too. So, limes are set here and let's get the guacamole part. Oh wait, no, we gotta shred the cheese. Oh my God, oh my God. I got that tropical. Mozzarella. There it is. Mm. At the mixing bowl. That's all right. Uh, hopefully these look nice. Showing that only only the pretty avocados for the video. You said three avocados? Yeah, depending on how it fills up. Okay. Last but not least. 
I use the frijoles masher, the potato masher, to mash the mm. avocado. I don't know if you want to do this. Yeah, I'll do that. Where is that thing? It's in where the spatulas are. Okay. Oh, shit. Look at us. Look at us. Oh, yeah. You guys are cute. I don't think people are going to like this tutorial. <laughs> kind of long. <laughs> it's a long, it's, it's 16 minutes. And it's just, it's me not joking as much because I'm actually concentrating. I have sharp knives. So I'm like concentrating and not cutting myself. So it's like not even that entertaining. But uh, people ask over the years, how do you make mom's guacamole? So I figured I'd finally make a video. And plus this is YouTube. They can fast forward, right mama? Mm -hmm. They can fast forward. They will. they will, they'll fast forward. You know, I don't feel like editing and speeding up stuff. I'm just gonna give them give them a nice 20, 30 minute video. <laughs> Look at that. Okay. Yeah, you're right. Three was a good amount. Cause plus all this other stuff's gonna go in it too. So where's that thing? The frijole masher. Oh yeah, this thing works awesome. I think I'm just more funnier and more entertaining when I'm when the food's already ready mm. and I'm eating. Mm. This is more like I'm sure a, a decent amount of people will watch this, but well, you're a normal you. I'm normal me. What's normal me like? Like that. Tell me though. Describe me. Quiet. I'm quiet. Relaxed. Relaxed. Quiet and relaxed. Sweet. Taking a, I'm sweet. Adding some salt because I'm quiet and relaxed. And sweet. And sweet. Some black pepper. Pretty quiet when it's just you and me. Yeah, well, you're my piece. What do you want me to do? Putting some of this adobo. And, and there's not a lot in here. And there's like clumps on the bottom. So I'm going to put the other Goya adobo red cap in there too. Not, not too much. There we go. I'm going to put some extra gloves on now. Huh? Yeah, they're calm, quiet, and sweet. Both Which is weird because it's like that's not like the personality. I can I can joke around with you and be crazy me with you a lot. I do that a lot. I joke around with you a lot. Joke around in the goofy way. I like you. Oh, in the goofy corny way. Yeah, that's true. I do do that. I do do that. <laughs> crema? All right, we're adding the crema. How much crema in here? I don't know. My wife has perfected my mom's uh, guacamole start here. Start slow because you don't want to put too much. All right, start slow. I'm just going to put that much for now. I'm adding the cheese. Onion and tomato, mm -hmm. yeah, just a handful. Serrano and lime. Cilantro. C 
serrano just i'm not i'm not gonna cover it in serrano just a little bit lime roll this out don't we have one of those lime crushers yeah where's that at You know, Mamma. Oh, my God, oh, my God. In the other one. In the back. In the back of what? Of the little island door with the forks and stuff. In the back. Is it? I don't see it. Come help me. No, I'm not coming on camera. Come on. Nope. All right, I guess this guacamole is not going to be limey. I'll just use my strength. Well, you're supposed to roll the limes. I did. The I just did. It's all right. I'm strong. Oh, look at that. Oh, y'all like that? Uh -huh. uh. <laughs> That's not the real you. That's good. Now it's time to mix elation. I mean, Rocky will be the taste tester. And Rocky will be the taste tester. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He likes guacamole. He likes guacamole? Mm -hmm. No, he loves guacamole. He loves guacamole. But not as much as he loves your mom's frijoles. Yeah. Rocky does love the frijoles that my mom makes. He's had them since he was little. You're right about the crema thing. You gotta mix it in and see what it's like, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, ever since you guys picked Rocky up when he was seven weeks old, he's had frijoles. <laughs> ever since he was little, he's had frijoles. That's probably the first thing your mom gave him. Probably. We, we probably didn't have dog food right away. <laughs> Plus, frijoles looks like dog food a little bit. You know? You don't know no better. Okay. It's mixed, and it should look like this. But now, it's taste test. Taste tested. Needs more of everything. More serranos. A little bit more onion. The mater. So lunch. The cheese. I think I might cut up some more cheese actually wasn't enough. All right, let's mix this bad boy up again. Oh yeah, oh yeah. 
It was very mild, the first taste test, mama. This one should be it. But the real, the real approval comes from Rocky. The real approval comes from Rocky. Man, this is gonna be a 30 minute video. I like this. Oh yeah, the thumbnail. With the guac. With the guac. Added more lime to it. Taste testing it out. It's good, but I feel like it's not spicy enough. Wanna try? Here. Is it done? I added so much extra. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it's I think it's done. I can get the heat from the back. No Serrano heat yet? I got a little bit of it. Okay. Should I leave it like that? Yeah. Okay. Or should I add one more Serrano? Either or. I'm going to leave it. And that's it, guys. A bunch of avocados, tomato, onion, cilantro, lime juice, seasoning it up. Can't forget the uh, mozzarella cheese. Crema. It has to be this one, guys. Nestle Media Crema, table cream. Sometimes the packaging in other stores will literally just say table cream on there. So you got to make sure, okay? But that is my mom's guacamole. Let's get this thumbnail. Mmm. Thumbs up the video if you like it. Thumbs down if you don't. Comment, subscribe. Go check out my TikToks. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.